Well, you weren't. You weren't kidding. <laughs> it's a giant chicken. Hello everyone, my name is Lotus and welcome to the first ever episode of Minecraft. I got Jonathan with me today. Hello guys. And uh, this is gonna hopefully be a reoccurring series with uh, me and some pals, hopefully. Uh, mostly you. My... Yeah, mostly me I think, because I build a lot and work a lot. But uh, hopefully I will be able to uh, kind of showcase my world and the progress that's being made on it. So this first little episode will, I will just kind of show you around and then later maybe I'll show some actual progress. But there's a lot to show so maybe we should uh... get started. Yeah. <clears throat> right now we're standing on our official offices, um, the JAL offices. I guess we could start on the bottom floor. So we got some plans for this. This is all completely unfinished, but we got some chest room, uh, like sorting system ideas and furnace ideas. Yeah, we're we're prepared with uh, plenty of hoppers because I'm supposed to make a sorting system down here, but yeah, haven't gotten to it yet. Exactly. Up here, I will be doing the kind of media entertainment part of Yarl. So I'm, I'm expecting cameras, green screens food buffet tables and stuff, you know, just any old soundstage or like um, recording Hollywood, whatever, right? And up here, personal offices, maybe some cubicles in the middle and uh, the window spots, we're probably going to get private offices. So one for me and one for you. Yeah. You can decide whether you want the ocean view or the town view. I'll take the town view, I think. Yeah, it's very cozy during the night, it lights up and stuff. Uh, but I, I like the ocean as well, so that's very nice. Well, we got some practical buildings. This is a cow farm, an egg farm. Actually, more of a chicken farm. We got some sheep just stacked in the building here. That's no, no farm. And uh, a sugar snack, sugar cane farm, which is actually really, really useful. Yeah, then we have really the uh, townhouse or town city hall, I guess. Uh, there's really no point to it. At yeah, it's moment. all really all uh, like in progress. I can show you a proper map later. That is kind of incomplete. Yeah. Um, then uh, we have our pier with uh, yeah, a lighthouse with a crappy looking roof that I've built. So yeah, you can really see the difference in building quality. Me? It's really good, mate. Lotus. Me? Fantastic. Lotus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, you put you put up these light posts as well. Yeah, true. I did something. Uh, mobs still spawn here, so I mean that's still a problem, but I mean we have lights. Yeah. Got some more useless buildings here, these are just purely aesthetic. Uh, same on the other side, we might add something, I'm not really sure yet. Up these steps is access to the bridge, um, which is elevated so boats can actually go under it. And uh, rather straight and modern I think. And yeah. here's also Astley Towers, the rival of Jarl Media Entertainment. And it is actually a creeper farm disguised as a, a skyscraper, so... I recommend checking out Nembon's video. Most of my farms built on this server are uh, inspired and... Well... Just designed by Nembon. Great guy. Um, over here as well, I'm guessing you went to Wolf Isle. No, are you over there? Stop. I did. Over here, yeah, no, this is a bit of a map actually of just the coastal area. And you see, this is the river. We've kind of adapted it here. And this is kind of uh, uh, law wise, I'm thinking this is like the older bits of town. So, this is where it all started off in this corner. Got a bunch of weird little buildings. I really just went wild with the different palettes. The streets are getting older, they're more worn and torn. So, it's more, more differentiation in the. And the tiles here, there's a little market, a quaint little market, that's a bit weird as well. <laughs> um, everything's a bit weird. We've got a nice church, I can show you that. And I'll yeah. probably have a time lapse of this actually. Oh, nice. Yeah, which I'll insert somewhere now. <laughs> Thank you. 
Saint Wolfs. Yeah. yeah. Kind of derived from uh, Saga's love for wolves, and then I kind of uh, went oh, into that. The ones I slaughtered. Yeah. So we got some books at the back, so you can bring your psalm books and sing a bit. A fireplace in a church. Don't ask me why. Um, <laughs> a nice carpet. We got one of these, uh, the water thing you dip your baby in. Yeah, you baptize them in that. Yeah, here's the sinning booth. So if you've sinned, confession booth maybe. <laughs> okay, so we're Catholic. Uh, absolutely. Okay. Um, actually, it's Temple of Notch. The ch the belief of Notch, whatever it is. There's a bit of a shrine, a nice view of the rest of the town. Uh, and upstairs is not much more than just bells. Um, Ender dragons in, in this texture pack, which is Excalibur, by the way. 1.13.2 uh, or something, right? Yeah, sure. I and the uh, and the shaders is Sildas, which I also deeply recommend for sure. Yeah, uh, but exactly yes, look pretty good. Yeah, the catacombs, which are is the recent addition. Um, I think adds a lot to the whole city vibe. We got just some normal chambers for two two deaf people, but here is actually an interesting one because this, if you. Have the honors. Connects to Sagi Bragi's secret shanty moon... bar. <laughs> yeah, moonshine cooking shanty bar. Yeah, A nice aquarium and all that. I think all the fish are dead now. They're still there. That's quite impressive, actually. Yeah, there's there are a few fish. Seven. So you can actually close this. Uh, it's not completely flush, but it does work. Um... Uh. It's, it's. I think it's supposed to be flush. Actually, it's just that it's not working. <laughs> uh, <I'm> like, <laughs> well, oh, uh, let me do some troubleshooting here. Wait. Um, <laughs> uh, Quick edit. Sh shit, that did not work. All right, guys. Um, I mean, when it's my own design, it, I mean, don't expect anything to be good. Is that not powering? There you go. Five minutes later. Um, and then I'll just hit the floor here and get out. Boom! That was an easy fix, right? Now just rid of my stuff here. Uh... Okay, so now it's fixed. Perfect. Look at that. Ingenious design by me. Alright, let's go through and then we skip to another part of the server. So, where are we headed? Damn it! I'm going home. Wait, I'll be right back. <laughs> I I gotta craft minecarts because the system has run out of it. I have one. I have one. I need one as well. I have one called Betan. Uh, so, don't place it really, just put it into the hopper. I throw it onto the hopper. Hop? What? Oh, that hopper. That hopper. <laughs> and then. Uh, stand on the pressure plate. This should be di dispensed. You yeah. click on it, and then it automatically goes when you're in it. Okay, yeah. Goodbye. And at an intersection soon, you will have to press a button. Uh, going to the right will go to the end of the farm. Oh, I mean, sorry, to the, yeah, the end uh, and the stronghold. And if you go straight forward, you will actually go to another farm. So which one did you press? Neither. Uh, press the one furthest away from you. Shit. <laughs> it did not, I, I was really stressed there. It does not work with multiple players. Uh, <laughs> I'm going down South Park on a have myself time. Friendly faces everywhere, humble folks without temptations. Going down South Park, gonna see if I can't rewind. Okay, here we are. 
Here we are in the nether farm, uh, and this is also a design by Nembon. And it got ridiculous amount of wither head drop, so that's mostly why we um, built it. But as a bonus, it actually produces uh, a relatively good amount of gold, and of course a ridiculous amount of coal and bone, so we never have to collect that ever again. Um, but the gold is a very nice bonus because I've actually used that and I have uh, a spare beacon of gold in my ender chest at all times. But it's a very cool design, easy and stylish. Um, so just press this lever and it should lag as hell because a thousand slime block pushes up there in the sky. I'm going to start pushing monsters down in this one by one area. It's also a really rather advanced like pickup system. We my god. And you just stand here with your sword? Not anything. And uh, you can have some really, really good drops. You get That's... plenty of XP from this as well. Yeah, I've gone to 100 a couple of times. I've, right now I have 66. It's, you know, double the I only have 60. Yeah, so if you ever want to enchant, that's why I have the enchanting room behind us as well. Oh, sorry. Shut myself in the way. Anyway. That was my first leather wither head, apparently. So in this short amount of time, I've already gotten eight levels. Yeah, right. it's rather efficient, actually. Yeah. It takes a little bit to cool down, but it works. Yeah. And all those drops that were just dropped from that, except the ones you picked up, uh, which if you don't have like a full inventory, which I recommend having when you actually do this farm. Everything just automatically goes into here, and yeah, when it's... I'll go throw everything up there that I picked up. What kind of nether portal is this? This one? It's a 3x3 three three nether portal. You can make any size you want. What? Really? Yeah. Where's my minecart? It's it in the dispenser. This one actually works. If you go off the plate now, it, it will go back. It, it's, it's not in the dispenser though. Yeah, it's it's a lot of hoppers down here storing all. What? Why do you want one? Because it's called Betan. Oh, <laughs> you have a special mine. I'm so sorry. Um, you might ruin. I'll the be right back. There we go. Yeah. yeah reset the system. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Back to business. Here is the end portal. Yeah. And uh, let's wait a bit, actually. I can quickly go back here. This is the stronghold, obviously. And the stairs up to the surface, so if you ever want to fly here, it's a possibility now. A bit easier, at least. And here you can collect sand. So just like the gravel mountains, here you collect sand for stuff like concrete and stuff as well. And there's <laughs> now a, a small beacon giving you a was it speed or was it haste one might have just been haste one because i'm stupid haste yeah why not but let's go in though. here and i'll show you <clears throat> the really wonky um leaf don't die from this please die from what from falling guess all my stuff would get ruined Yes, yes it would. And already you see the um, ridiculous amount of endermen spawning on this platform. It's it's a stupid amount. And to the right here you see the and um, the teleporty stuff, ender pulse. Okay. All you do, stand here. They can't hurt you. They don't even see you because of the trapdoors and the uh, s s blocks I'm standing on the solar detectors. Okay. And uh, I should probably stop killing them because I will get too many enderpearls. Might, at least. 
But yeah, there, there's no buttons to this, there's no redstone, it just... Being away from everything, just this much void makes them spawn ridiculously... A lot. Yeah. Since they have no other place to spawn, right? Woo! Let's go, boy. <laughs> Fuck, I almost fell off. So, we're on the top of Astley Towers, and we're gonna be doing some adventuring part of this episode as well. Uh, I got myself some... Uh, in my end chest, I got two compasses and emeralds, and I'll be attempting to get the woodland map from, yeah. from a from, villager. From a cartographer, that's what we found. In a very nearby <coughs> village. We actually got a little path here that goes all the way. And he's tra trapped inside this for the most house. This guy. Boom. Boom. And we wanted the other one as well, didn't we? The ocean explorer. Yeah. To... I, I see us in the southwest, so northeast then. Right, let's go northeast. Towards northeast though. The oh right, West, towards the north. iron farm and like the gravel mountains, etc. We gotta sit around the fire. How, how do the fire works? It's cold, son. Grab yourself a bed. Grab yourself some fireworks. There you go, son. Thank you. One stack. No. Straight north. Oh, there oh. it is! Look at that! That's a huge. Massive. Yeah, it's enormous. What's the okay. entrance? It doesn't look too bad for it. I'm switching oh, to um, the texture pack again. Where's the entrance? I'm, I'm really... I'm really impressed! My god, look at this! I think the entrance is on the other side. I don't actually know where it is. Here it is, yeah. It's completely hidden. Let me just... pull some blocks. Um, How many torches have you prepared? I have one. I think you took all my torches. When Such I died. Accusations. When I died. There we go. We'll be needing it, trust me. Cheers. Um, let's take this. This place is dark. And spooky. Blue. I think you picked... No, okay. I picked up the torches. Okay, so... There's a pumpkin in here. <laughs> okay. Okay, so there are zombies. Are there any special mobs in here? On the top floor, I believe there are uh, wizards uh, called invokers and like... Oh, damn it. Do you have the anvil with you? I do not. It broke. Damn it. I totally forgot. I was going to do something funny. There's, Who's that? There's that, a guy in straight jackets. Yes, that's the Johnny guy. The oh, they actually hurt quite a lot. They drop emeralds. If you name that guy Johnny, he'll he'll become a, an ally and kill enemies for you. Here's Johnny. Uh, yeah, exactly. I it's a reference I... to that. Oh, we have pumpkins. Uh, not pumpkins. Melons. Oh, um, do we have melons? I think we have seeds. Uh, I can hear a wizard. Where's that a witch? They're called, they're called like provokers and invokers and stuff. That's a witch, yeah. The hmm. the wizard is actually seriously cool. Like what I've seen from him, he's properly animated. He's, oh, treasure chest. Empty. Well, I guess we're trying to find a way up to the upper floors, right? Yeah. Whoa, there's, the, there are lots of chests here. But all empty. Are you sure? There might be one sure. with like... Hopeful thinking. Oh, Johnny! That's the wrong weapon. Um, he, hits f he hits four hearts! With diamond armor. Okay, yeah, maybe we should switch out the Elytras. Yeah. For sure. So he just hides in a corner, <laughs> rushes out when you get close. <laughs> oh, the, uh, the stairway is straight in the middle. I uh, don't know when I leveled up, but. There's a river running through the house. Oh, that's a feature. For sure. <laughs> Getting closer to nature. And a secret room. Look at that secret room. What? 
There was no entrance, but I simply just dug through the wall. And there is an efficiency one axe. Are we supposed to cut down the tree with that, or...? Maybe, I don't know. Oh, there's nothing there. I kind of don't want the efficiency one axe, but... Alright, uh, second floor, here we go. We can make this into a farm. Emerald's farm. That'd be a good idea. But I'd... It'd, make, it'd be it's a lot... It's miles and miles away, though. Oh, bedrooms. Yeah, I found one as well. Made of wool, not actual beds. That's old school, that's how you used to do it. Back in like half Whoa, whoa! What? He's waving his hands! Ah, I must fuck be... Oh. oh, you bastard! And there's a skeleton. That's the wizard dude, he's waving his hands. Oh, you killed him before he did anything. I got a golden head. Wait, what? A golden Totem head? Totem of Undying. Oh, okay. Don't, don't kill the wizard yet. I want to see what he does. Oh! What? Fuck! That's a conjurer or something. Oh, head. Evoker. So they're, they're the evokers. What does this guy do? Don't don't shoot him. Don't shoot him. That's the guy who killed him. Or that's the guy who summons stuff. Yeah, yeah. I want to see what he does. He's uh, out. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, a snake attack as well. That's pretty cool. What does he do else? Do you do something? No. <gasps> Fuck. Okay, he has AOE as well. Um, the close range. Out. Okay. Can I kill I him mean, now? Yeah, you could kill him now, I suppose. Dropped another one of those golden heads. And his own head. I wonder if you drop your head. Fuck you. What do you mean? Uh. Ouch. Wow, look at those windows. The race. God oh. race. Whole new game. Whole new game. <gasps> Hello. You handle them. Well, here's a statue of a giant chicken. Really? <laughs> <laughs> this place is amazing. Oh, <laughs> oh you weren't you weren't kidding. <laughs> it's a giant chicken. These, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die from these guys. Seriously. Just kill the invoker. I need to place down. Uh, this is my bedroom. loot chest. What? What are they supposed to be? Bathrooms. And here we have a, like an attic. The name tag. One of those guys dropped uh, a diamond shovel with unbreaking three. <laughs> what is this? A, a changing room? Oh, maybe. And then on top you have like an attic. Really? With beds. Like a oh yeah, one of those like loft areas. Yeah. 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 Loft. American. There's, Are there's an entrance up there. Or is it just a bug? Well, there's a hole at least. Here's a staircase. You found another staircase? Yeah. Oh, yeah, good. So, there's, are we done here? Oh! I guess. There's people behind the staircase. Behind the staircase? Yeah, down here. Ow. Not very nice. So are there supposed to be more than one kind of wizard? No, I think that was it. Just the invokers. Uh, Another yeah. chicken statue. Nice. 
Oh, there, is there anything in there? Uh, I don't know. I didn't check. Um, um, I'm not a. Oh. Real doctor. That's inappropriate. Um. <laughs> you just carved him up. Just, yeah, he's split in two now. Let's just fix his bomb and all that. All right. <laughs> oh, a strategy room. Cool. Oh, the totems of undying don't stack. Really? Oh, creeper. Oh, shite. Kind of tempted to take all these bookshelves. But I'm not. Oh, was that a balcony now? It's more just of a roof. Roof. Well, there are plenty of rooms here. Nothing in them, though, but. There are rooms. Yeah, I mean, judging by. I, I guess this is it. What What is this? Is this like some kind of map room or...? I literally pointed this out when we got in here. <laughs> oh, I didn't listen. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. It happens. I've done it. I think it's... there's some kind of balcony. Or maybe it's just a... Yeah, I've it's said this roof. as well. Oh my gosh, yeah. Does it look there like there's supposed to be another floor? No, I think that's the top one. Okay. I think that was it. I mean, I, for us, it was incredibly rare to find this, but I mean, it is, con considering it's random, having really, really good loot in a building that someone could possibly find right next to spawn, it would be quite unbalanced. Still. I mean, the wizards were pretty cool. They have animations and stuff. Yeah. Chink, 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 chink. Oh, look ahead! Ha! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, I mean, this place is pretty great, actually. But yeah, I love how its nose is three D. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's just like. Uh... I mean, the the place itself is great, but yeah, the loot is meh. I think Totem of Undying is actually pretty good. But we we do have keep inventory, or no, we don't. No, we have I mean keep... we have keep levels, but. Yeah. Not... The totem of undying literally just reses you as soon as you die on the spot. So. Oh, okay. But I, s I think that actually has to do it. So if you just stand next to me, please. Thank you all for watching this first Minecraft episode. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Yeah. Bye, guys. Yeah, we'll catch you later. See ya.